Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are taking the sledge out. Look at this place. This is gonna be absolutely amazing. So yeah, I had the vendetta back here. I stopped by a place, a road, another road near where I live. I thought would be good because it's freshly paved. It's really nice, but uh, it has some like humps going through there and yeah that just it's not gonna work because I, I can lose line of sight on this thing too easy ah it sucks but is what it is all right we got our fire extinguisher we got our fan to cool this thing down check it even got our GPS module holder from RC Guy Garage that holds the uh, GPS right here. So I can strap it somewhere, probably around the battery. But we're not gonna speed run today, so. There we go, there we go, all right. But. Initially, I was going to bring the X Max out here, but uh, I kind of did some more content running the X Max once I fixed that shock. So I figured let's take the sledge. And I think I made the right call because this definitely looks like we can get some speed going. And it sucks. I really thought I'd do, be able to do a speed run out here with the Vendetta. I mean, it is just such a long straight road it is just straight there's going to be another road right here that they haven't paved yet but you got this it's just long and straight but there's like a manhole cover like there's five or six right now. and i mean you know you got a little car at 100 miles an hour it's not gonna work uh-oh i'm kind of afraid if they see my footprints here they're gonna know that i've been coming through here but ooh see that's my only problem with the sledge that they really should have put something here to prevent this from happening so look at this Oh yeah, man, look at that. Made easy work going up that. I was really hoping there was gonna be more in the way of jumps out here. Ah, there's not. Hmm. Man, look at how bad those front tires like blowing up. I believe the answer is putting like uh, earplugs or something like that in that center diff. Look at that. Oh, this is like so hard because I've been raining it forever. <sighs> yeah, 
Yeah, traction's almost at a premium out here. <laughs> I've never been somewhere with this thing that it's been so traction limited. Kind of fun, it's like drifting with the, with the off-road here. I mean, look, it just... Ah. I think that's like my only jump that I'm gonna have out here. Ah. Oh, let's see here. Oh, that looks like mud. Oof. And you guys gotta understand like how hard this dirt is. It is so dry and hard, like They're trying to jump down and high hopes for this place I thought there's gonna be so much like ramped up dirt that I could jump off of but yeah these are just such deep ruts from these uh, tractors coming through here even walking on it it's really hard in other words I'd be like I would launch it off of here and land but the stuff there's so hard you know see see look how it just bounces over that stuff it's like hitting a brick wall Well, good thing ain't nobody out here because my car sitting all the way over there wide open <laughs> uh, yeah well you know here in Florida I don't have a whole lot in the way of at least where I live if I was back in Tampa where I grew up I might have better BMX tracks and places to go like, where I'm here is nothing man Ooh. that could be fun until something breaks or it flips and then I gotta walk up that thing to try to retrieve this thing. Oh man. Uh. 
know, this kind of sucks. I mean, you know, it's always a good time you're out here running your RC, so that's always a bonus, but I want to find a place where I can, I can get some jumps. Ooh. I love the sledge. It's it's so fast. It's like a small RC car with the speed, but it's it's almost X max size in its capability of being able to plow through stuff. Like if I took the rustler out here, it would not it would not handle this right here. There ain't no way, especially like that. There ain't no way it would handle going through this stuff. And this thing, just with ease, with absolute ease. Oh, that was a cool jump. No, no, no. Oh. Oh, man. See how hard these it is between where these uh, tractor marks are. So I have to be careful. I got because if I go full speed, they're almost as high as this thing. I don't want to smash it into something. This is kind of boring. Sorry. Let's try to find our way out of here. Jeez. Man, did you see it climb up that? No problem. sledge man she never uh, fails to disappoint so uh, I really wanted to catch some air and do some stuff because this is like a basher but man it is such a great like speed machine for straight run plowing through stuff like this it really is that's I love how fast this thing is so. <laughs> all right everyone hope you enjoyed today's little uh, run out here in construction area sorry i thought it was gonna be so much better but all you could do is take a chance come out here and try so i'm trying to find new and better places to run the rc so you know with the heat that we got going on anymore as soon as i get done running take these battery packs out let them breathe a little bit one twenty five so it's not bad one twenty 120. Ay, ay, ay. 
So another thing I like to do is I go ahead and put this fan on here. Give it a couple minutes, let it just cool off the electronics. Because it is just, it is very hot out here and uh, we don't want to hurt anything. So, oh, make sure, okay. So, sorry everyone, I was really hoping for a better, more exciting place to run. But all you could do is come out here and try. I'm trying to find places. It's very limited here. Uh, so, doing the best I can. Hopefully we'll find someplace really good. I mean, there... The BMX park is, is cool, but, you know, you can only do that so many times, I guess. Or maybe not. I don't know. Every time is always different. You hit that same jump a hundred times and always a different outcome. But uh, So we're trying. Uh, I should be getting up with the guy later this week to do some flying. Teach me how to fly so I don't crash my plane so much. <laughs> so I should have that coming up. So I hope you enjoy all the RC stuff, planes, cars, and that. Hope you'll subscribe, like, share, comment. Definitely appreciated. Thanks for watching and uh, hope to see you on the next one.